The Chevrolet Colorado is holding up well after its relatively recent market entry and has a respectable reliability rating. According to NHTSA records, the 2019 Chevy Colorado has so far received about 80 complaints and no recalls. Although the truck has had its ups and downs in the past, the stats for the 2019 Colorado indicate a significant improvement. While the previous year's model did experience some issues, such as leaks inside the cabin and drivetrain vibration, the transmission-related problems have improved since the older models. Even though the transmission problems on the 2019 model were less severe, there is still room for improvement. The truck competes with the GMC Canyon, Ford Ranger, and Toyota Tacoma. Let's take a closer look at the 2019 Colorado issues. It's Max the Car Guy YouTube channel. Subscribe and let's get started. Faulty oil filter inserts. A few owners voiced their concerns about this. When changing engine oil, extra care must be taken when removing the oil filter's insert. Regular removal led to insert damage and engine failure from an oil leak. The owners also mentioned that numerous other people have reported having the same problem on unofficial forums. Transmission vibration issue. The truck has been plagued by this problem for a while, and the 2019 model also received numerous complaints about it. The majority of the reports claimed that the transmission would cause the truck to vibrate while in motion. Several times while shifting gears, the transmission jerked and caused the vehicle to lunge forward. According to reports, the shifts were also challenging. Torque converter issues. In a few instances, the owners complained that the torque converter needed to be replaced because of a lag problem. The report also noted that the issue persisted after the replacement. The powertrain slowed down and hesitated to accelerate while driving. Smoke from engine. The owners submitted a total of two reports mentioning this issue. According to the reports, the owners spotted smoke coming from under the hood while they were driving. Backup camera blue screen. Several reports have brought this up. The truck's reverse camera display, according to the drivers, displayed a blue screen and the message service backup camera while the truck was being reversed. Electronic fuel gauge malfunction. The gauge would read full after the gas tank had been filled. However, the gauge would suddenly change to the E position while you were driving, and the instrument cluster would flash a reminder to refuel. Infotainment issue. This problem was mentioned in the complaint about the fuel gauge malfunction. The infotainment system of the car, according to the owner, was also problematic. With iPhones, the system's Bluetooth connectivity didn't always display incoming call and message notification, but it did so flawlessly with Android phones. Power steering. Several owners brought up this problem. According to the complaints, the truck's power steering system intermittently developed issues and became difficult to use while moving. This problem also affected a number of owners, and several models from the 2015 model year were also recalled due to a related problem. Should you buy it? Due to its impressive towing capacity, comfort, smooth ride, and excellent maneuverability in urban areas, the Chevrolet Colorado has been a popular choice in its segment. Despite all the favoritism, the truck has historically struggled in the reliability department, but the brand has been working on it as evidenced by the improvement in the most recent model year. Buying a pre-owned vehicle could be dangerous, especially if you choose one from before the 2018 model year. The 2014 model has received very few complaints thus far, making it a viable option. On the other hand, the Ford Ranger might be a good choice because it is more reliable all around than the Colorado.